Why, hello there! <laughs> Welcome back to Dota's Our Adventures. My name is Mike B. As you can see, I have a plank, I have rocks, and I have a science machine. Yes, I did, in fact, build a science machine real quick. I felt like, you know what, it makes no sense to run around without a backpack, but it takes two seconds to build something I already pre-built. Remember, I pre-built this thing. So it's like, why not just do it? Then I can break down the machine and get some of the resources back, and then we could just get the F out. There we go, perfect. Now we go. Now, hunger is going to be a little bit of an issue uh, somewhat soon, but all you have to do is basically just go and find something to pick on, and then we will be fine. Tall bird and whatnot. Uh, Crockpot should definitely be high on the list of things that we need to rebuild uh, pretty early on, pretty quickly, right? We really need to get that actually going sometime very soon. I am going to pick up rocks. I'm going to pick up all this stuff on the way out. Actually, I'm going to fight this bird here. I'm not going to worry too much about the... Uh, I built a log suit almost just almost exclusively for the... Um, for the, uh, uh, not for the mitigation, but just for the sanity. You know, I can just tank her. Tank, tank it. Let's do it. Look at that. So, yeah, let's see. It doesn't, this is, this is one of the things I discovered in the last, uh, the last take, I guess, uh, where I basically just was face tanking so many things and it was just scary because there's so many opportunities where I could have just wiped and maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Hello. I do want to work on my skills, though. And three. There it is. Good. That's uh, not quite a full stomach, but it's getting there. And I have a pickaxe. Might as well go and get this thing going. Oops. <laughs> Just straight drop it on the ground. Whoops. <laughs> there you go. Oh, and the gold nugget. That was kind of the main thing I wanted there. All right, uh, we'll go ahead and split. Uh, I'm going to take the egg. No, leave the egg. Can't remember if they spawn without the egg. All right, you know, the little chicken before the egg thing? I can't remember if that applies to tall birds. Or wait, or is it egg before the chicken? Which one? I guess that is the question, isn't it? I was like, which one came first? Oh, yeah, duh. That's, that's the freaking question. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. Uh, logs. I do need to get some logs for sometime soon. I should have prototyped some uh, opulent stuff, actually. Then I could not worry about flint, like, ever again. <laughs> Pretty much. Hello, pig. Too close. I didn't actually catch his name. I wonder if that's the same pigs before. Oinky. Who's this? Tiberius? Yeah, those are the same guys. These are my trees I planted, actually. I believe so. Hey, aren't these my trees? No, they're not, actually. They're kind of set up in a strange formation. Like something that doesn't give an F, but I guess it could also be or just randomly placed. So there you go. Funny, sticks is one thing that you don't really think that you need a whole lot of. For me anyways, I don't really I don't never like think, oh man, I need to make sure I stock up on sticks. Cause they're always just kind of there and you always just kinda of go through like trickle through them little bits at a time. But man, when you run out, it is like you're just like, oh crap. <laughs> My world is crashing down around me. I don't have sticks. You can't make so many things, man. Yeah, we're gonna do a little bit more logging here. Probably convert some of them into, uh... Because we already have a stack. Nah, nah, actually we won't make a stack of, uh, of planks or anything yet. That's a little overkill, I think. I'd like to max my stack of... Of, uh... Logs, though. Because sure get a lot of charcoal from this. Just from flick of a switch! <laughs> nice. And then we'll do like one more here. One big one. This guy here. This guy looks like he's ready to go. And maybe one more after this. Just because. Grass is another thing that we're gonna be running low on soon, because it's another it's like it's like the twigs, right? It's like you don't you, you don't necessarily need a ton like at any given time, but you slowly trickle through them. Gold is that thing that you could just basically stock up on and never run out of, it feels like. And when you run out, it's not the end of the world. At least for me, it's not. Well, now that I have Wigford, though, it might be a different story. So what we're looking for is not rabbits. We would like to find some beefalo. Now, this early in the game, we're probably not going to find a lot. We'll find some. But... Not until I believe like winter do they start or uh, sorry spring do they start actually uh, uh, respawning. 
<laughs> do they start mating and having kids and whatnot? So, um, yeah, don't know if we'll do any like, let's go and beat up a bunch of beefalo super early on, especially without a crock pot. And without a crock pot, of course, we don't have, um, well, without a base, we don't have any place to hang meat to make jerky. So yeah, there's a lot of things we have to do. We're just so busy. I'm not gonna mess with the wormholes or anything just yet. I am like, I swear I've never gone to wormholes. I don't know why. I could just jump in there and try it real quick and then come out and like beat up a rabbit or something and then I'll get my sanity back, but I just don't. I don't know why. Don't know why. No idea. I'm gonna actually bought a little too much now. Kind of overkill. This looks a whole like the starting area. Birch nut. AKA a birch nut monster in the summertime, I think. I don't remember, but. Wow. Wow. All right. Her hunger, by the way, is not as, uh, her cap is like 112 or some strange arbitrary number. Uh, it's not as much as, uh, as some of the other characters. I do see a little sliver of land that looks kind of interesting to the left, which is why I'm going to the right. <laughs> Don't question my methods. Just kind of scraping the side of the fog of war here. That's what it's called, by the way. You guys know that, right? Can't be called nothing else. Let's see. The flowers. Some frog legs. Fish. We'll go fishing eventually. How I long for a feast. And it's nighttime. We're gonna have to stop at some point, cook this meat. Did I pre-make a yeah I did. Okay, good. Whoa, this goes up higher than I thought. Holy crap. Okay, yeah, so here's the edge. Let me make another one of these in a second. I don't want to stop moving. Oh, the shipwreck boy. I could set it on fire. <laughs> oh, how hilarious would that be? Hey, what's this? Whoops. There you go. Let's go out. Let's come on. Three, two, one, two. We're going to have to start uh, refining some grass anyway, so we might as well pick up a bunch even though we don't necessarily need a ton right this second. Sleeping bags and all that. Ooh, this is an interesting looking area. And there's a whole lot of area over here we've not yet covered. Oh, man. Should I just perimeter this bitch? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, yeah, here we go. She can't eat, like, the other birch nut seeds. She can't eat those, obviously. But I think you could mix them with something else to make uh, it, like, into the meatball mix. By the way, I don't remember who it was, unfortunately. And I'm sorry that I don't. But uh, one of you left me a comment that broke down the, um, the some, some, some of the core uh, principles of cooking. Uh, so, like, morsels equal 0.5 meat. Right. Um, small jerky is 0.5 meat. Uh, monster meat and like the meat slabs, like this guy here, right? Meat. I guess. I guess just meat. Uh, oh baby. Uh, they net you. I uh, can't see the tribe because of the words. Here we go. It's one meat, and so to equal. Oops. To equal meatballs, you need two meat. Uh and. Two filler. Yeah, 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 that's it. Two meat, two filler. I mean, I'm experimenting a bunch. I experimented a lot in the lo in the lost season. Maybe we'll call it the lost season. That's a good one. In the lost season, I experimented a bunch, but still, I even after all my experimenting, I still was not. Oh my god, this could be it. Yes, we have fucking found gears and a qualifant. Fortune smiles upon thee. Where are you? Let's go get this guy. Can I see it on the map? Nope. Well, I know where it's at, though. I'm gonna need to stop and cook some stuff, though. Hold on. <laughs> Maybe I'll just eat something raw real quick, because this thing's gonna drop a shitload. There's a frog right there. We can just beat him up with his legs. 
This is ridiculous. Come on now. Catcoon. Let's see. Okay, let's do this because this is going to take a minute. I'm going to cook, cook, cook. Yes, hurry up, hurry up. Just eat the whole damn thing, all of it, because we're going to get a ton of it in a second. Good. Ooh, chasing is going to be a bitch. That's fine. We have all day still. There, finally. Did I rotate the map back the way it was? Yes, I did. Good. I don't like... Oh, hello, hello, hello. I don't like rotating the map because... You end up, oh baby, yeah, you go right in that corner. There we go, yes, stay and fight. Stay and fight. I should just go and do this real quick just to make use of that. Take no damage, basically. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, I'm very pleased with that. Great. Wow, we're, we're super set on food. Like, we're, like, so ridiculously set on food right now. And we have gears coming up, so we're going to have a fridge. Oh, my God, I'm so excited. I am so excited. Where am I on wood? Good on wood. Sticks. Good on sticks. Let's go up here and beat up these guys real quick. And then, um, what is it? Just one dude? Oh, just one dude? Oh, your ass is mine. Come here. Come on. Do your thing. Yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it. Yeah, sure, that works too, buddy. <laughs> oh! Oh, you know what? That's just, you know, the mitigation is so strong. Oh. <laughs> what do you got for me over here? I, do, what was that? Ball butter? No, what is that over there? Hold on a second. Let's get our gear back. So we have two gears. That's two fridges. We're actually going to use both of them. Um, four fridges. I think I need to get rid of something here in a minute, but let me see. Honey. Huh. Let's, um... Let's set a fire. Not too big of a fire. Jesus, don't know. Get, get, get. Oh my god, oh my god, it's gonna get... I don't even know what the heck to use this for, to be honest. <laughs> I really, truly don't. Uh, let's see, we'll drop this over here, because we're gonna use that as fuel in a moment. What is this? Oh, heal, huh? Oh, I definitely don't need that. <laughs> I really, truly don't need that at all. I'll go drop it here. And then we'll add fuel. And let's see what he has in his backpack. Oh, one more still. Good. What is in here? Oh, nothing. Oh, man. Chump. Chump ass. Really? I'm out. Keep your honey bullshit. Actually, no, I'll take the honey thing. What should I drop? What should I drop for honey? Let's drop the one plank. <laughs> Seriously, we keep carrying this damn thing around. We're just, we're just wanderers right now. Just travelers. In this land. And we're we'll going to take this. The land of... Of what? What is, what is the thing? Of something and honey? What is it saying? I don't know. Whatever. Is it like babes and honey? God, what is it? That's like David Lee Roth or something like that. Anyways, we'll grab some sticks. We'll get moving. I saw that one stupid cube. I do plan on using these things, by the way, because we need them to make the uh, make uh, uh, the doodads, which is why I ditched the planks and not this. All right, we gotta go down. Where are we at here? Yeah, let's go ahead and go down. We'll finish. Might as well go ahead and finish scoping this area out here. Berry bush, see we could start pulling those up and moving them to uh towards where we're gonna set up shop, which we don't know where that's at yet, but we should probably we should probably actually settle uh sometime soon. Pick a spot and just call it home. Just two gears is a little disappointing though, but 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 I'm not mad. I'm gonna cut across here just because I don't wanna I don't wanna go any farther in because I have a feeling that right up in this area somewhere right like here basically where i started i think which is like right here somewhere uh, i think that's probably where we're gonna set up shop there's already a bunch of berry bushes there and all that <laughs> cats
Pounce of green. Unless, whoa, what is that thing? Pan flu, huh? I don't know what that does. I'm sure it's useful. Does that statue show up on the map? It does. Good. Oh, did we find the pig king already? No. Oh, maybe, actually. Maybe we did. Oh, baby. Wow. We are just scoring. Oh, he's sleeping. I can't give it to him. <laughs> Yo, wake up, man. Wake up. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey, listen. All right. How about this? Let's go ahead and set up a... We'll set up a thing here. Right in front of the pig king. That's right. Like we own it. Like we own the spot. You know what? Where's this thing at? Geographically. We might actually set up here. I think I might go ahead and put one of these guys down. And I think I might go ahead. Oh, you know what? This area is going to super suck uh, when... Huh. When, uh, when it's a full moon. Or will it? Because if it's a full moon... I don't know. I don't know. What do these things do? I don't remember. I don't remember. The obelisks do something too. They react to something. I can't remember what the heck it was. Uh, anyways, this is a doodad. So yes, I did want to make that. And also wanted to make a... Let's just make some room in my bag. Do a quick this. And then we will make another cube. Cut stone. Make another doodad. And then what we'll do is we'll prototype one of these. We need four planks. Two. There's our wood, right? That's why we need a ton of it. Uh, and what else do we want? I uh, want two more stones. All right, what's up? Yay! You bought six or something, right? Something like that. Yep, uh, five. Well, no, it was six. Lies. Oh, no, maybe not. Yeah, look, there's berries here. I mean, really, the only thing I have to defend myself against is, is just when, when it's a full moon, and that's it. When it's a full moon, I basically gotta camp somewhere else. It's like, you know, like when your mom and dad get into a fight, your dad's gotta go sleep on the couch. Like, that's pretty much what I have to do. Is that just me? Surely you guys... Surely somebody out there had the same thing. <laughs> so yes, we are gonna set up a... Uh, maybe even a temporary shop, I'm not sure. Uh, but we are gonna set up stuff here. Uh, let me see, it's not time to eat or anything, but let's go ahead and get... Oh man, a fridge. Yes. Oh my god, a fridge. Unbelievable. We're gonna make one. One stone. Beautiful. And then we're gonna prototype it by walking over here. Good. Perfect. Oh man. I can't even tell you, man. I can't even tell you how happy I am right now. Uh well, let's see. Uh but there's still more to do. Like, go over here and rob them of all these uh, berries. Actually, we don't need many. We're going to make uh, a bunch of meatballs, and we'll leave them in the fridge, and we'll just basically venture out, and we'll come back whenever we need food. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and take one, two, three, and yeah, it's a little bit more than we need, but it's fine. Come on. Come on out, turkey. I know you're in there. Oh, wait, don't the turkeys are so small from those ones. I can't remember. Uh, let me see. So now we got to make a crock pot. Three more stones. Man, wow. See, this is why we got all those resources, baby. We got all those resources just because setting up shop is so expensive. Drop some poop. Drop some poop. Oh, okay. All right, so here we go. So we go cook, cook. Some of you guys are going to be like, oh, man, you finally figured it out. I'm still experimenting. Still experimenting. I'm still messing up. <laughs> How about that? I'm still <laughs> experimenting is kind of the wrong term. It really is. I'm still messing up. Uh, but I am. I, I do know how to make meatballs for the most part. So I will wow you with my <laughs> with my my work in that in that regard. Meatballs. And then I'll go ahead and make some more. Then we'll go and throw some more in there. So I'll go cook, cook. Uh, what happens if I just put one in? I don't remember, but I don't want to risk it just yet for right now. Uh, cook, cook. And then we'll do that. They don't steal... They won't steal from the crock pot, right? I don't believe they do that. 
Not my, not my pigs. They wouldn't do that. This is going to require some room, actually, so I might want to go... Uh, give myself some room somehow. No, nah, I don't think they will. I don't think they can interact with that object. Yeah, we'll just build it along the river here. River, lake, ocean, whatever. Okay, let's go ahead and eat. Uh, we're actually not going to eat either one of these. We're going to go ahead and add a fuel. Using logs, which is silly. I shouldn't have done that. Sorry. And we're going to cook this. And then we're going to eat it, because this is going to give us basically full everything. Boop. Okay, we're not full, but close. Let's see. So we're going to go and store this. And we're going to keep on cooking. Keep on cooking. Go one, two. And we go one, two. Perfect. Cook that. And I want to make one more of these. So I make three more ropes. It's amazing how much stuff that we just went, basically went from nothing to just having like a, a mini base here. Winter's coming soon, by the way. I don't know exactly when. Not winter. Uh, uh. The. Oh, uh, 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 there we go. Full moon is coming soon. And then what we'll do is we'll put these up here just to dry. We can always. Once they dry, we can always use them again later if we need to. Uh, and then let's see. Gotta make some planks. Ooh, we are actually running low. Yeah, we have to go chop some trees, it looks like. Uh, I was gonna make, basically put a um, uh, structure. Put down a, is it the first thing there on the left? I forget, yeah it is. One of these things. I might actually re rebuild some of their... This fucking cats, they're so dumb. Although I, th I should get rid of the cats. Sorry, they just, I'm sorry, so sorry. I, I love cats, but not here. <laughs> Actually, this is a good opportunity to test to see what the, because uh, I forget what uh, three and uh, three fruit, or three filler and one meat do. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Yeah, I just can't have cats near the base. They'll pick up stuff and they'll they'll, they'll steal things and all that. You can give them stuff and they'll, they'll help you out, but it's only lasts like a day. Like, you go to max, seriously, the max that you can actually have loyalty from a cat is a day, which is way longer than real life. Let's see. So we'll go store. Yeah. What else should I leave here? Probably this massive stack. Let's go and prototype ourselves. It made meatballs. Son of a bitch. It was. It was one in three. See? I told you I was still learning. I did preface it by saying that. Yeah, it was one in three. So I wasted a bunch of meat. That's fine. It's easy to get meat. Boy, some of you guys are clenching. Ah, <laughs> uh, let's see. We're gonna prototype this. We're gonna prototype that. We're gonna prototype this. Oh, no, 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 no. Actually, not that one. We'll save that one for a uh, rainy day. The beasts are approaching. Oh, beautiful. Yes, please, please do. There we go. We'll get this. They're gonna approach. I'm not gonna be able to fight them because I'm too busy. My bags are too full of garbage. Uh, so we could eat this uh, here in a sec. Actually, we eat right now. That'll fill us up. Max. Mmm, we'll take that. Let's see. Let's actually arrange our bags real quick while we're waiting for these dudes to show up. Probably ditch a couple of things. I don't need to ditch much. Just a little bit of uh, rearranging here. Let's so put that there. Uh, we are down to three logs. So yes, we do need to go chop some more trees. I thought you guys really were surprised. <laughs> of course we got chopped down more trees. There's only going to be two in this batch, by the way. And the pigs are probably going to eat or uh, fight, do most of the fighting here. Let's go ahead and light this fire. Oh, get out of the screen. There we go. I'm just, there you go, let's do one more. Oops. There we go. Should be coming soon. Come on. If they come in the morning, they're definitely screwed. Those pigs are gonna wake up. And they're gonna defend their king. Defend their king. Hurry up already. Let me get some grass. 
Here we go. All right, where you at? Oh, I should probably put this on. Let's do that. We'll do it right. Bam. All right. Face tank. Pigs wake up. No, don't eat it. Don't eat it. No, no, no. What did he just eat? What did he eat? All right, I don't know what he ate, but <laughs> definitely not something I made. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and make a couple more racks. So let's see, we need six more of these. If we can afford. Four, five, six. And what we'll do is we'll go, we'll pick up, we'll pick up vegetables now. Um, because we can feed these guys to get uh, poop in, in return. So we should definitely do that. And let's go ahead and make, let's get away from this thing so we can actually see what we're doing. Uh, a couple racks. So dry and rack. Can I squeeze that in there? No, can I squeeze it over here? Yes, I can. Fill up on that waste all that meat, but that's fine. I was, I, yeah, then the lost season, I believe I was experimenting a little bit with uh, two meats, squeezing in a monster meat or something like that, but I can't remember what the outcome was. <laughs> I purged that entire run from my brain. Anyways, let's see, where are we at? So let's go and explore the area around us, chopping down trees as we go. Birch nut trees, sure, I'm not gonna discriminate. Not the little ones, though. They may live. Good. I think I can probably feed them a birch nut too, actually. I don't know, I don't think they'll eat that. I've I I, I feel like they're not they're not really into eating birch nuts straight up. Oh, there we go. Then we go and get the gold one. Yeah. How quickly we've gone through so many resources. Oh, another birch nut. Wow. I gotta figure out something to do with those. I guess plant more birch nut trees. <laughs> Actually, I don't want any birch nuts anywhere around me because of that crazy ass monster that spawns. And I have no idea when, what triggers there, how it shows up, or what season or whatever. So I would be more than happy to just go through and just chop down every single one of these trees and just forget they even exist. <sighs> but hey, we won't do that right now. Birch nut. Hey, buddy. What you think? What do you think? Give. Oh, he just eats it. That my space. You want to eat another one? Nope. Okay. Well, whatever. Bacon. Stupid name. All right. So they do crap for us. So we'll just use them or drop them somewhere. Whatever. Use them in something. I don't believe you can actually put them. Even put them in the crock pot. We'll see. I'm so glad I have a fridge, guys. We could go and farm up all. Oh man, we're gonna farm so many glaciers when the when the season hits. Right now, let's get wood. Lots of wood. Then we're gonna go we're gonna go probably tomorrow actually and adventure off and do some more exploring, looking for touchstones. Uh, more gears would be nice, but not not a necessity. Actually, I should probably use this next gear to make another fridge. Yeah, that would not be a, a bad idea, actually. Hmm. Let me think. Yes. We're gonna use that gear to make a fridge. Then we're going to make, yeah, yeah. Because I don't wanna have a touchstone event occur <laughs> and I'm unable to survive because I'm gonna die, you know, because of summer, right? Which we may or may not have seen happen before. There we go. Twenty-seven. I would like two stacks, just because planks kills it. But after you, after you're done building and prototyping all your plank bull crap, you're pretty much good to go for a while. Just with, with 40, 40 logs the last few while. Clear it all out. I should really look. You know what? I'm not gonna throw this away. I'm gonna look up and see what I could do with birch nuts because that's just too many just to toss. Or use as fire or uh, as a uh, kindle kindling or fuel for the fire. I do have a shovel. I could, I could like not be an asshole and go through and uh, dig all those uh, stumps up. But nah, 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 nah. I'm good. And here is my twenty stack. Perfect. Two twenty stacks. 
Oh, well, I guess I'm gonna have. That's fine. You know what? I am gonna go and use this. Just because I'm gonna start a fire in a minute, and I could just use it as just some as my fuel. Burn through it real quick. Or we'll do the job. What is over there? Nothing. Okay. I don't think there are any other downsides to hanging out here, right? <laughs> I'm just trying to think. It's like, is there a downside to doing what I'm doing here? Setting up a shot? I don't know. I don't remember. I honestly don't remember if there's something... Something's gonna happen. Besides, of course, the pigs freaking out. But, again, they're all inside, so... They won't come out when it's... When it's feeding time, right? <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see. Fridge. Let's go and prototype another fridge. We're gonna go and make another one of these. Thank God, we have so many rocks. Prototype boot. Good. And then we're just going to make a uh, we'll need a regular pickaxe. So let's go ahead and get that prototyped or built rather. And then we will make ourselves a thermal stone. And we stand next to the right one. And we're gonna take this thermal stone and we'll put it in here. And then we have the resources, so when we go somewhere else. Uh, whenever we find a touchstone, we'll put a uh, fridge next to it and a thermal stone in it. Uh, and then, of course, whatever other resources I could throw around it, we'll definitely go there. But I think for now, we're probably good. We've got a good amount of just general resources and things. Um, let me go ahead and... Why is that lit? That's a bug. Yeah, that's a weird bug. Anyways, let's go make one of these. Then we'll throw it in the fire. Whoosh. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's it. So I'm gonna figure out what to do with these birch nests because I'm pretty sure I can't put them in here. I think I tried this already once. Yeah, that's what I thought. So I'll see if there's anything to do with them. If not, then I'll just toss them or do something else with them. I have no idea. Uh, we have two stacks of wood. We've got food. We've got plenty of uh, basically everything else. Uh, sticks. Oh, well, look at it. See, I told you sticks, man. Sticks and grass, actually, both. So we'll have to do a little bit of exploration and find ourselves some sticks and grass. Tomorrow me. Sticks and grass. Sticks and grass. All right? And take some meatballs with you when you leave. As a matter of fact, I'll take care of that part for you. No problem. We'll eat this. And then I'll go and open this up. And I'll take some of these. So we'll take uh, just half. <laughs> there we go. Uh, the rest is not going to really take that long. To, like I can just carry it with me. But I'm going to do it anyways because I have a fridge now. No, actually, I am, I am going to take it with me because now I'm thinking about it. I probably will run just kind of trouble while I'm out there and I will need it. So that's it. <gasps> Thank you for watching. Don't starve adventures. This is Wigfrid. My name is Mike B. Get out of here. That looks weird. See you.